Hi, in this video I will show you how to use Excel as X to TSV uh, converting app. This is my website, I will leave link on this site in the description. To download app, I will type in search Excel as X to TSV and just click on it. Now double click on the download button to start downloading process. I will leave link direct direct link to the app page so you don't have to search it but just in case uh, you can search it on your website so i'll click on downloaded archive double click on msi inside archive and click more info here windows is displaying this uh, screen because i'm not registered publisher you can see publisher unknown i'll just click on anyway to start the installation click on next next install click on yes here and finish and you can see app has been installed on my computer. I have a shortcut on my desktop. Now I can close this and minimize this. And double click on the shortcut to launch app. Conversion is three steps process. First step I have to select the Excel file. I'll click to select input file. And find the file and click on next step. If my file has um, column names, uh, first row, like I can show you like, how uh, my file look like. Let's open it with Excel mobile. And you can see this is how it look like. And first uh, row is uh, first row has a uh, column name, so I will keep this uh, checked. Then click on next step, and to run conversion, click on run. And here I will specify name and location of the file. This name and location is OK. I'll just click Save. And file has been saved to TSV. I can go and see the files here. So basically that's it. We have a TSV file. If I have a file with multiple, uh, multiple uh, data uh, sheets in it, I will, I will ask, will be asked to, uh, for folder and it will create multiple TSV files. Because XLS, X is it's an Excel file and it could have uh, multiple spreadsheets, multiple data, but you cannot save it into one TSV file. This is why uh, uh, you'll be asked to have different. Uh, let me show you. For example, I have a uh, um, US and Canada states. It has a two spreadsheets with different states for US and another spread spreadsheet different for Canada. So let's open this one, click on next, click on next and run. It will ask for folder because it will be multiple TSC files. For example, if I want to place it into my documents, I just click my documents OK and you can see two TSC files created, US states and Canada states. So it will be saved into two different TSC files. Yeah, so basically that's it. If you have any questions, please leave them in comments. Thank you.